Mm-hmm. We, we just have two seasons, you know, like raining and dry season. I mean, like uh, wet or dry season, yeah. But when raining season here, all of us we work at rice field. We plant mm-hmm. rice, you know. but when hot season or dry season, we really dry. I mean, we can't work at rice field because when hot season, our rice field like dry, like really dry, and then no activity when the dry season. And then for another job here, we will take a second job. Because like the first job for the girl, like the hand weave, hand weaving, like uh, they make like a scarf, like shalom, like a gear. That uh, from the cotton, they make the skin the cotton here because that we go into cotton and garden, like outside. And uh, about the color, uh, we use a natural color. Like from the turmeric, from the, like from the indigo, from the tree bark, that we use for the color. And still with the traditional equipment, still with the manual. Later inside, you can see everything because weaving in the village is helpful for the girl because before they can weave, they can't marry. Mm. For the reason, yeah, before she can weave, she can't marry. But for children, already learn from eight years. Every mother in the village, they have to teach their girl about the weaving from eight years because 20% of the Sasak girl or in Sasak uh, girl in the village married about the age like 15 or 16 years old already married. Yeah, like the 90 percent of the sasak girl because uh, for the ladies in the village they can't go anywhere i mean when they will work outside of lombok for example or outside of indonesia it's not possible <coughs> yes there are for the sasak girl their activity or their life that's around the village is when raining season and the farming when the dry season they do like you yeah, yeah. indonesia because uh, is that not i mean uh, not possible uh, like uh, like for the ladies here but uh, but for the next, for example, when some girl, like, uh, 